Panchayat season 2 ending explain what's next for Abhishek Tripathi will there be a season 3 but before that make sure to subscribe our channel for further updates Season 2 of the TVF comedy drama series Panchayat astonishingly brings back the same charm that it had spread all throughout its first season and in many ways perhaps even adds on it to its depth. While season 1 was almost like an initiation for the protagonist Abhishek Tripathi and also for us audiences to daily life in Falera and its problems, the new season takes more political and social matters into consideration. The show's writing and acting performances remain top-notch and where the new season flourishes more than its predecessor is in successfully portraying all shades of emotions. With season 2, Panchayat holds the potential to make one cry as much as it makes one laugh and remains an absolute must-watch. Panchayat season 2 plot summary, what is the new season about? After Abhishek Tripathi's unsuccessful attempt at the CAT exams, the Panchayat secretary lives on in the quaint village of Fulera for one more year of administrative work and his own preparation for an MBA. However, the young man is now more settled with village life and has fewer bursts of frustration than before. He now gives off the sense that the Panchayat Secretary he is able to look at the villagers' unique problems as his own. His bond with the three colleagues, ex Pradhan Bridge Bhushan Dube, Deputy Pradhan Pralat Pandey, and Office Assistant Vikas is now even stronger as it has gone beyond friendship on its way towards kinship. The last time we saw Abhishek in Flera was atop the tall water tank tower as he made introduction with Bridge Bhushan's daughter Rinki. It was almost felt that he had taken a romantic interest in the young woman of similar age and the writers seem to toy with that same feeling as no romantic relationships or anything even close to it has been established between the two. Instead, Vikas and Pralat are now stuck with the same feeling that viewers were stuck with, that something romantic might be going on between the pair. Although their hunch is quickly blown away by Abhishek, a sense of romantic interest does indeed cook up quite slowly towards the end of the season. The show also has villains this time, one in form of a political potential rival to Bridge Bhushan and current village Pradhan Manju Devi and the other as a corrupt government MLA. There is also an air of political urgency in the season, with village elections quite close by and the Pradhan and her husband look for ways to keep their voters happy and in hand. Abhishek Tripathi continues to find solutions to all such problems one after the other, this time more committedly while also keeping up his preparation for CAT and dreams of IAMs and MBA. Despite some exceptions, the majority of Panchayat Season 2 present its problem through the character of Bhushan, a troublesome villager who keeps hatching plans against Bridge Bhushan and his administration. Bhushan was earlier seen creating a ruckus over the population control slogan which compared having more than two children to having piles and now he returns with more ways to paint the two ways in a negative light in front of villagers. Meanwhile, talks of Rinki's marriage with an engineer hailing from a nearby village are advanced and two families decide to meet. The meeting never happens though as two sides mistakenly land up at two different restaurants and the groom's father then insultingly looks down upon Bridge Bhushan over a phone call. Despite the marriage being called off, the groom keeps calling Rinki even after she asks him not to and from different numbers as she has blocked his number off. It is with this problem that Rinki first approaches Abhishek personally, asking for his help in the matter. Abhishek smartly calls up the man and threatens him with a case of harassment, faking to be the inspector of the area's police station. He and Rinki then gradually develop a mutual interest, but one that is never expressed by either of them or by the show itself. The chemistry instead builds up over awkward but meaningful glances at each other, shy conversations and their individual friends suggesting that something might be up between the two. The second negative character and a much wilder one is introduced towards the end of the series. In the shape of the region's MLA, a corrupt and egoistic man who never indulges in any government work without looking at personal benefits. Panchayat Season 2 ending. What stopped the prayer program from being held? What is next for Abhishek? This season introduced another character most absently but ultimately integral to the plot. Pralad sons Rahul who is serving soldier in the Indian Army. Pralad who became a widower some 20 years ago mostly lives alone but cherishes the company of his son when the young man visits home on holidays from his duty. With Panchayat's brilliant success and also the structuring of the season 2, 
it is perhaps obvious that the show would return for a third season where abhishek lands up next if the transfer order stands would be the biggest highlight as it might change the entire setting of the show although that seems unlikely also how the panchayat elections take place and what's its ultimate result turns out to be is something important finally whether any serious romance ultimately cook up between rinki and abhishek also remains a question as a man is intent on leaving the place soon and yet finds himself attracted to the women